Hi friends, welcome to free online tech videos. My name is Ravi. In this video session, we are going to see about dig command. So, what is that dig command is used to? Dig command is used to um, resolve DNS issues. Example like uh, if you have DNS and uh, whether DNS is working properly or not you are getting the proper domain information or not so using dig command you can verify so dig is dig means domain information grouper so that it it group this dns information so querying the dns database so before jumping into the dns or this dig command so we are going to see that few records which is available for the DNS records so which are this so the type of record is A and uh, which is IPv4 address so and uh, type of record is AAAA and uh, IP version 6 IP address IP address version 6 IP address okay, it, it suppose that IPv6 okay C name is an alternate name or al alias name for the uh, DNS record example if you have a big name for the server but if you wanted to call it as in a short name you can use um, this canonical name record or alias name MS record which is used for mail server mail exchange okay or mail server record so it is which has a high priority on the DNS which is also very faster comparatively other DNS records NS records with just any name server names like the DNS name server okay PTR records it's a reverse record for the the record of A okay so P point pointer to a canonical name okay and um, you can also say SOA authoritative information about the DNS John what it means that whenever you query the information to the DNS if it is authoritative query which you are sending the within the network or the within the DNS zone then that information which comes from the DNS is authoritative txt is in a text record okay now let's see that so how it's going to be we are the dig command is going to be work okay using dig command you get it is bind utilities okay yes and it is going to be installed dependencies as well installed now i from the root and edit resolve.configuration file and here which has the name here and add the same one more record name server mm, in this case I'm just adding the DNS resolution to the Google server okay now go and run this information which provides the your record so how the record has been fetched and what is the reply it got from the dig command you see here so which is queried this dig inf dig utility so 9.9.4 this is the ip address we just get switch uh, query that so, and um, got the answer what is the answer we got so one query has been sent zero answers and authoritative is one okay because we added that 8.8.8 .8 that's why it's an authoritative dns okay and the question session so it sent an information to 8.8.8 .8 saying asking for the record a and in the authoritative section which is replied block with that so as i said soa is in the sense authoritative information okay and which sends the information back saying that this is the information but we did not get proper any information here because answers are zero okay like this we can use this dig command to resolve these dns related issues okay or else you can also provide dig space 
the domain name or the server name so it will also fetch the information so here we got the answer you can see that right here we got the answer what is that answer so we got the answer saying that google.com what is that record a and that google.com is resolved by this ip address so the query time is 4 milliseconds and what is the server we send the information to that that server 192.168.2.2 ip address so this is the information like this so you can get this information or you can also get a detailed information from the dig command if you want to use uh, options okay you can also use dig uh, iphone 4 for ipv4 address okay example say i am just querying this ip and this ip address so i got the un no answer i got i got no answer because it does not resolve any information here because they were secure servers so you cannot get the server name here okay and uh, you can also use dig iphone x which provides a detailed information about the server or the the dns record dig iphone x you can see that so it's going to be provide some detailed information okay whether you got some the, the record is see this the record in a reverse and the record here and what is that ptr record and so authoritative record and from which server it got the answer all the stuff like that you can use the dig command also you can also use a different methods like dig iphone t if you want particularly some uh, example say a record from google.com then you can use the type a then query that so you will get the uh, that type record you can also use uh, uh, ptr record iphone t ptr record google.com or you can also use uh, ns record you can also use mx record if you have mail server okay this like this you can query the information or uh, to the remote remote servers and get that dns verified in the sense the dns um, records verified whether the dns is giving us the proper result or not you can also use so many options here like uh, example i say one of the biggest query here so like uh, no dns no fetch all this stuff will be there in this see so this is what the information we are getting so much of information right what is say that dig please query this in this server and from any and saying that local host resolution to the ns record and no no query so we got six answers from the remote dns record say it's in a details answer section see that ic.org all this information you can also see right you can verify whether if you install your local dns whether your local dns is working properly or not your dns records are uh, getting properly or not you can verify using this d dig command the dig command also store uh, return some return codes example if the dg dig command is written zero in the sense everything is fine in the sense no error if it is written 1 then which means that the usage error if it is written 8 could not open batch file okay if it is written 9 means no reply from the server which means that the dns is not serving any record or any query result to the remote host okay 10 means internal error some internal error which means that you did not con configure your server properly to pointing the dns server or something like that okay you can also resolve multiple host at the same time okay say that i am just writing some file name here file name and in this i am just writing the records okay maybe something like this or you can also write anything right maybe names or ip address and uh, use dig command and iphone f provide that file name file name okay 
it will resolve all this server's information and provide you the display in the single go okay you can right see this all the records information we got first of all it sent to the 127 the second record which is sent to the 8.8 .8, the third record which is sent to the google.com like this using the dig command you can get the dns information and verify that whether dns is working properly or not that's about the dig command stay tuned subscribe to the channel if you like the video press the like button thanks for watching please follow us on social networking sites if you have any technical related questions you can ask